Today, we will be using a simple pendulum to demonstrate the law of conservation of energy. A pendulum works well for this because at the top of its swing, it has 100% gravitational potential energy. As it continues through its swing, at the bottom of its swing, it converts gravitational potential energy to kinetic energy, and then it converts that kinetic energy back to gravitational potential at the top of its swing. I have devised a unique test to determine students' understanding and belief in the law of conservation of energy. We use a simple pendulum to test students' understanding of the law of conservation of energy. Students are given a pendulum and instructed to hold it next to their nose or chin. Thank you, Emily. And then release the pendulum. And if they are able to remain in position during the swing, I know students understand and believe in the conservation of the law of energy. Here you can see the point at which we release the pendulum. When the pendulum returns, you will see it doesn't quite come all the way back to its starting point. This is because some of its energy is lost to friction in the pivot point. This is what it would look like from Emily's perspective.